good evening dear students the intention behind this video is to explain you the question paper which which was given to you all a uh, few days back okay now most of you are not able to understand certain parts of the question or the way how it should be replied answered okay so looking into the inconvenience that you or the problems you people are facing this particular video is being made anyway to start with uh, the question paper is all of uh, half yearly examination 2020 20 subject computer class 6 okay full marks is 50 okay the first one fill in the blank okay uh, fill in the blank with proper words number one dash refers to a process of creating program b dash languages were developed after low level language number c dash are also referred as referred to as assembly language number d windows 7 was introduced with dash edition number e the first version of windows media player was introduced in dash number f we can start a new row by clicking on the dash button button number g to finish the process of merging we have to click on the uh, on dash link number h dash has a great way to present data through slides okay so these are the fill in the blanks and you need to answer them this fill in the blanks will are available in the book itself in the exercises now number two question unscramble the following words okay now these few words are given okay uh, if you put the letter in proper word they will form the in itself a meaningful word these are also there in the book please do refer to the book number three write t for true statement f for false statement okay so whether it is true or false you need to write a number a low level language is no different from machine code whether it is true or false please write number b java is an object oriented programming language created by james go go in 1996 whether true false please write number c operating system is the interface between various various hardware devices whether true or false number d the merge that covers the desktop is called iron icon sorry the, the image that covers the desktop is called icon whether true or false to finish number e to finish the process of merging click on the ribbon tab whether true or false number f we cannot select receive recipient from an existing list or create a new list right in word whether true or false number g a chart allows you to communicate your data gra gra geo uh, graphically on a slide on a side whether true or false number h five into six means the a table with five sorry six columns and five rows is it true okay so please find out this and these questions are also there in the book so if you refer through surely you will find now number four okay number four is answer answer the questions reading the text see friends uh, till now up to number three you you will be finding the questions in the exercises but for this you will have to read the chapter okay you will have to read that chapter only then you can find some of the answers uh, you will be finding the answers uh, without reading uh, simply uh, expecting on the youtube videos or answers that i have given that will not work you'll have to do a little bit of hard work to find the answers number one how many charts okay how many charts categories are available in powerpoint 2007 okay 
नंबर बी विच टैब इज यूज टू इंसर्ट टेबल इन पावर पॉइंट नंबर सी बाई क्लिकिंग ऑन विच बटन यू यू कैन स्टार्ट अ न्यू रो नंबर एफ द फर्स्ट स्क्रीन दैट यू सी ऑन स्विचिंग ऑन द कंप्यूटर इज कॉल्ड डैश नंबर ई सी वॉज क्रिएटेड बाय डैनिस रिच इन डैश ओके सो सी में जिससे प्रोग्राम है ओके सो दिस टू फाइंड दिस आंसर्स यू हैव टू रेफर द बुक You have to read the book without reading. You won't find the answer. Number five. Let's see what is the question. What are the advantages and disadvantages of second generation language 2GL? Okay, so you have to make the you have to write the answer for those advantages and disadvantages. It is available in the book. Okay, in a table form. Okay, it is available. So please do write those. Number five. Draw. Uh, sorry. Number six. Draw a. Uh, the component of media player and name them okay the components there is a media player in image okay that you'll have to draw and you'll have to name the parts of it number then finally presentation of your answer carries three marks the way you present whether you are answering very nicely or a, a very clean way or not that way you'll be getting uh, you'll be allotted some marks that is 3 marks okay so best of luck okay do well and hope you answered you answer the questions in a proper way that's all thank you